Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Terra Nova and today I am bringing you part number six of my Sims 4 Harry Potter 7 Toddler Challenge. Welcome back and uh, if you are just tuning in, be sure to check out the last few videos of this series. Um, I'll probably link them down below if I remember. If not, it's not that hard to find them. Just go right to my channel, go under playlists, and it should be one of the first ones up there, the Harry Potter 7 Toddler Challenge challenge and uh, get to know our cast before I jump into today's part because today we will be focusing on all of the fun new things that came with the new parenthood pack. So I have avoided most of the content that has been released in this new pack. For instance, this new nightlight, this new nightlight toy, this new curfew board I don't even know what it's called anymore. And then this little little set here, those little little cubbies with the towels and the, oh, it's just so cute. But anyways, those are just a little tiny tidbit of all of the new things that came in this pack, as well as all of the new gameplay mechanics. So I haven't even I know there are, I know there are uh, little things that you can do. I know there's new items you can do, especially for children. I did get the uh, block board to play with toddlers so our kids can play on this and um, that's about all I've got but I know that there are so many new interactions we can do so let's jump right into the game here and see what we can do we have the music playing Ginny is dancing her heart out Ron is on the potty with Severus teaching him and everyone else is sleeping all right so Voldemort's included and Lord Voldemort he <laughs> needs sleep so badly he also needs fun really bad but luckily he's dreaming about guys Voldemort was just dreaming about unicorns <laughs> oh man but luckily luckily our maid should be coming at like 10 a.m. so she can help with this he can help with this mess that we have here excuse my uh, misuse of pronouns our maid is Albus Dumbledore so he will be helping clean up this mess and uh, someone had commented on a previous video that um, Voldemort can teach the group how to dance or help the group how to dance so we can help with his fun as well as all of the toddlers so that's really nice that's something I want to try as soon as he wakes up all right it looks like Ron reached potty at level two and uh, Ginny reached movement level 3, so she can now walk faster and dance to music. That is good. She really wants to listen to music, so we'll just have her listen to the kids' radio. Someone also said that we can play a lullaby on the radio, and it helps the kiddos actually sleep better. So that's something we might try. Alright, so she got the imagination skill. Ginny is getting hungry, actually. So let's go ahead and, um, can I get food? All right, she has to ask Severus for help with that. And Ron is doing really good, guys. He went potty all on his own. I'm so proud of our little kiddo. And uh, this must be shining because we have new things. So this is what we have. Character values. So we have manners, responsibility, conflict resolution, empathy, and emotional control. So we need to work on these with our kiddos in order to influence the type of adult they'll be. So uh, that's going to be interesting. I'm sure we've got so many new interactions we can work with. But I'm going to have Ron come on over here and go to sleep. Ginny, stop listening to music and please ask Severus to get some food while he mops with his invisible mop. That must be something with my mods folder not working out. Um, oh, we can play in the garbage can, you guys. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, potty accident. She wants to ask Lord for a drink. She's going to ask Severus for some grilled cheese instead. I'm going to go ahead. I want to set the curfew. Voldemort, set curfew. Oh, we don't really need a, a curfew because we got toddlers. They can't even get out the door because I don't let them. All right, Severus, are you going to get food for us? I think he is. So she also wants to play with nesting blocks. That's something that we can do. Let's check out our kiddos here and see who's ready to wake up. So Draco should be waking up any minute. now. he can actually wake up now. He, because he's using his diaper. Draco, you can pee on your own and you have to use... Oh, Alright, so that's disgusting. Put that in the kitchen. Severus, why are you not getting food for our toddler? Um, food. Can we, do we have to talk to Stranger? Is that what's going on? Because she only knows... Uh, is it because she only knows Voldemort? Alright, food... Do we know him now? I think we do. Oh, someone is upset. 
Can we ask Severus to... We can't ask him to do much, can we? Um, Butler responsibilities. Okay. So I think I'm going to have Draco come over here and start right off the bat. Why can't you play with the blocks? Can you play with this toy? Um, play with the toy. Why can't my toddlers play with these blocks? Really? Can only adults play with it? It said toddlers only. I swear to goodness it said toddlers only. I cannot believe it. It's, if that's going to be something where only adults or children can play with, I'm going to be very upset. But I'm going to send Jenny to bed before hopefully she doesn't starve to death. Um, Lord Voldemort, please wake up and have Severus start cooking something. Uh, butler, assign task, cook a party meal. So Draco's playing with his little, little thing there. Um, I'm going to have... Uh, I'm going to have Lord Voldemort start off by cleaning these right away, and then he can go ahead and use the toilet on his own. I don't much care if, uh, I don't much care if there's puddles. I really just want these empty so the kiddos can use them. But Draco, how are things doing? How are you doing? Oh, he's so hungry. <laughs> Alright, are you cooking? Severus, hurry up. I don't, I don't have time for this. Alright, Voldemort is doing really good with everything. Be gross. Belch. Fart. That's new. Let's see if he farts. Oh, that's so gross. The evil lord can <laughs> fart. Alright, actions. Alright, so the rest of that looks pretty. Shout forbidden words! Not in front of the kids, though. Please, not in front of the kids. Is it because he's evil? Or is it because he's oh, dastardly? The flubes. Oh. Look at him! He just shouted evil words! I must have missed it when he farted, though. Why don't you come over here and... I don't know. Clean up this nasty mess over here. And then we should probably have you empty the trash. Alright, so it looks like Draco is putting toys away. Ron woke up and he's crying because he had a bad nightmare. Okay. Well, why are you sad? Oh, he had a nightmare too. Alright. Uh, Lord Voldemort, please come over here and hug lovingly. That's so cute. Let's go ahead and comfort him. And then come over here and uh, let's check on Baby Draco. So toddler carrot changes diaper, first of all, because he probably stinks. And kiddo is hungry. All right, did you finish cooking the food? Oh, he did. Good. So we're going to have pasta. Primavera is the food of choice here. Uh, Jenny, can you please wake up and come over here and grab a serving? And Draco really needs a serving. And then Harry, not Harry, Ron needs a serving. He's very sad though. Um, Harry, why don't you wake up and see if you can come and use the potty quick before you eat. Hermione needs to wake up and come and use the potty bad. I'm not having her have a, ni a, a nightmare, an accident. <laughs> Alright, looks like Luna, not Luna, Neville is doing really good right now and Luna are doing really good right now too. Uh, Lord Voldemort, please put your scary outfit on. Um, belch first, because I think it's entertaining. Outfits change into your everyday. Let's watch him belch. I'm waiting. Don't change his diaper. Don't comfort. I don't care anymore. <laughs> That's so disgusting. Yuck. Ew. Voldemort, why are you so gross? Ugh. Alright, what are you doing, Tiny Draco Malfoy? Oh, he's coming over here to eat. Alright, well, what can you do? Why don't you come over here and dance? Dance, dance, like you want to. I want him to come and build something, too. I think that would be entertaining. Oh, he's gonna go and, uh, he's walking in circles. Can't you just dance? Alright, here we go. Alright, why don't you and Severus have a better relationship? Why don't you invite to teach dancing? Right, maybe that'll raise their friendship with each other. Because they really should have a better friendship. I don't care if he hates Albus, but uh, he should really like Severus a little bit more. Alright, Jenny, are you doing... She's doing so much better now that she has food. And Draco actually is doing really good now that he has food. He really wants to listen to music, though. So why don't you come on over here and listen to the music when you're done eating. Looks like, uh, oh, Ron is dancing. Or was he just laughing? I can't tell. Why don't you watch, Lord Voldemort? Um, bubbles! That's so cute. <laughs> Friendly watch. Alright. Hermione, what you doing, little girl? Listen to music and dance to music. Well, why don't you... Um, listen to the radio for a little bit. That should be a good start. And then go ahead and dance help from Lord Voldemort. 
She also wants to play with the nesting blocks too, so maybe we can have her do that. Ron, what are you up to, little baby? He wants to play with the blocks. You can come on over here and uh, stack. Maybe the kids need a certain level to do this. Oh, Elvis is here. Hi, Dumbledore. Dumbledore is, you know, taking care. Okay, why don't we talk to this stranger so maybe we can trick the uh, maid into helping take care of her kids when he's here. All right, Draco, what, what are you doing? Right, you seem to be in a good mood. You really want to go potty? I'm going to have you change into your everyday. Why don't you try going potty? And then you can babble to Lord Voldemort. All right, don't do that. All right, come over here and friendly... Oh, we can snuggle! That's so cute! Alright, let's snuggle. Maybe he can't babble anymore because he's already past that. He can talk now. Alright, Ron, why are you angry? Tired? Oh, he is really tired. Come over here and uh, go to sleep then. Ginny, come on over here. You really need to use the potty. You need to use the potty and you really need a nap. My goodness. Lord Voldemort, what are you doing? You can stop dancing now. Oh no, don't leave! Don't leave! Let us talk to you! Talk to the stranger, Harry! Oh, he's got stranger danger! New person alert! New person alert! Quick, I need a like to hide behind! Oh, poor Harry! Why don't you put your uh, everyday on and then just cry it out? Cry it out, sweetheart! So, this is Lord Voldemort attempting to make blocks. <laughs> Alright, so he's got his instruction book out and everything. He's getting the pieces together. Oh, wow, look at that. Is he making a toy we can play with? Or I have no idea. Alright, who's... Oh, that's, that's Harry crying. It sounded like someone was laughing. Looks like Neville has finally woken up. Oh, he woke up probably because Harry was crying. Alright, why don't you come over here and uh, stack the blocks for a little bit. Uh, Ginny is angry. Alright, she's still working on that. Severus is back. Ginny, not Ginny. I keep wanting to call her Ginny. Um, Hermione, what can you do? Why don't you make a mess? That's new. I know that's new. Alright, responsibility is low. Oh, I didn't think... Oh, she should be more responsible. All right, what if we... Oh man, look at her. She's making a huge mess in the kitchen. Oh my goodness. I didn't think, uh, I didn't peg her money to be one like that. I think she'd be very responsible. Uh, can you do me a solid here? <laughs> um, don't check on the toddler, he can cry. Come over here and we need to scold. How do we, how do we, parenting, okay, teach to say please and thank you, teach to say sorry, discipline recent behavior, strict, yell at for making a mess, alright, because we, uh, we don't tolerate that, alright, Draco, what do you want to do, hug lord, alright, <laughs> he also wants to dance music, so come over here and dance your little heart out with Severus, alright, so someone's throwing a temper tantrum, She's throwing a tantrum and she's making- oh, thank goodness. Alright, Harriet, come over here and eat before you starve and get taken away, please. Uh, Luna, what are you up to? You've just been standing here for the longest time. Please put some clothes on. I'm gonna have her come over here and eat, even though she's not that hungry. Uh, you can stop doing that for a little bit and start taking care of, uh, scolding these kids. Please- she's not done making a mess yet, oh my gosh. Hurry up and go! I thought you left! Elvis! Oh, Draco's talking to him. Can we, um... Let me see if we can do something mean. Hit! Toddlers can hit, you guys! He's talking about a T-Rex. Oh my gosh. Nasty little bugger. Alright. Reached parenting level 1. Lord can now encourage kids' behavior and influence kids to clean. He can now reprimand bad behavior by asking the child not to do that action or simply yelling at the child to stop. Alright, so he's a basic parent, guys. Basic parent level 1. Alright, are you done? Oh my gosh, she actually made a mess we have to clean up. Ugh, okay. Um, <laughs> okay, you guys are all hanging out over here. Ron is very sad. Still from that nightmare. Alright, why don't you come over here and go potty? And he needs a bath soon. Uh, Hermione got yelled at. Alright, so she wants to throw a tantrum. And she's tired. Okay. 
She's probably just hangry, to be honest. I'd be tired and hungry, too. All right, Harry's really sad. Why are you so sad? Oh, potty accident. Oh, kiddo. I don't know why this said toddlers only when toddlers can't even play with it. Why don't you come over here and play with the toy? So, uh, let's uh, open this up. We are gonna play with this monster thing. So come over here and play. Alright. So, oh, let's check this out. So, Hermione is, you know, more towards bad manners. I, I hope we can her help with her responsibility a little bit more. Neville has to pee. Please come over here and uh, ask for potty help. Not from Severus. Don't ask for Severus. Is potty help. I was hoping you'd ask Snape. Oh, look at Snape. He's cleaning up the mess Hermione made. <laughs> Alright, so what are you doing, sweetheart? Why don't you come over here? Actually, let's open this up. We'll open this and we'll get a book out. What can you do with this? You can play in? What? Come over here and play in the bookshelf. Look at them try to toddle. Alright, can we come over here and bite? Hermione, you are just the little devil in this part. Come over here and bite Lord Voldemort. The sassy little... Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's so sassy. <laughs> I want to... Emotional control. Oh, she's just... We're messing her up. And then... Oh my gosh. Luna is messing up the bookshelf. All right. I don't know why you're playful and loved. You just got bit by a toddler. All right. So let's go ahead and parenting discipline firm. Yell at for being mean because that will show her emotional control for sure. And then can we, what can we do? Um, let's go ahead and parenting. Okay. Parenting level two. I'm going to read this. Lord Voldemort can now influence kids to do homework. Lord can now firmly tell his kids not to do bad behaviors. He can also select more options when responding to a teaching moment. Interesting. All right, Hermione, now that you're just a mess, please go to sleep. You need the sleep, go to sleep. Ron is still crying. Voldemort, please come over here and uh, let's comfort him. And then you know what? We're going to go ahead and uh, toddler care. We're going to go ahead and give him a loving hug because I think that's so cute. Harry, how are you doing? You're actually doing really good. He wants to play with the blocks, though. So stop playing with that toy and come over here and uh, tower help from Albus. I feel like those two should have the best relationship, honestly. Why are you angry? Oh, because he's tired. Go to sleep then. Oh, go to sleep. Alright, Luna. Luna needs attention, so let's go bother Severus. Talk to stranger. Harry, are you getting... What? Harry, where are you? Come over here and get tower help from Albus Dumbledore. Alright, um, who's crying now? Luna's crying because stranger danger. Alright, come over here and uh, change her diaper. <laughs> and then read her a toddler book. That should calm her down. Alright, right, so you stop talking to Severus, please. Just just go ahead and grab the kid and go. Harry, are you still trying to get over here and talk to uh, Albus? Alright, can we please ask for tower help from Albus Dumbledore? Severus, get your butt out of the way. All right, Draco, what are you doing? Nothing. Awesome. He wants to dance to the music. So why don't you come over here and dance help from Severus? Come on. Oh my gosh, these people don't listen. All right, so come over here and stack on your own because cause Albus is not going to help us out. Neville needs some food, though, so come on and eat over there. And uh, how are you not listening? Why don't you adults listen to me? Come over here and uh, read to children. Read to multiple children. Perfect. Do them all. Read it to all the children. It will help their attention needs. Neville is eating. Uh, uh, Harry is playing with blocks. He can stop. He wants to listen to music, though. Are right, we going to go read? Oh, let's go read. Let's go read. What are you doing, little girl? Why are you crying? Oh, my goodness. She's so scared of Albus Dumbledore and Severus Snape. I should really get going now. Yeah, you should. You're not being a help at all. All right, so we're going to read to the children on Hermione's bed while she sleeps. Oh, look at their flocking to him. Oh, they sit down and listen to him. 
This is so cute. Oh, he's really getting into it. Look at this. Oh my goodness. All right, this is probably the cutest thing. And he's reading Charlotte's Pig, but apparently it's a story about unicorns and knights and dragons. I don't even know what to believe. Severus, why are you just standing here? Can I actually have him just like assign him to a new meal? Uh, more choices. Butler. Assign task. I can't make him do any like cleaning right now. Really? Um, stop gardening. More choices. Butler. Assign task. Cook a party meal. Alright, so... <laughs> Voldemort really needs to eat, so he really just needs to come over here and grab a serving. How are the kiddos doing? Oh, now Hermione woke up. She's crying. Now, why don't you come over here and dance? That should make you feel better. Uh, Draco needs some sleep soon, so he can just come on over here and go to sleep. Um, Luna needs to go potty. Oh, she needs potty help. Okay, why don't you ask Severus for some potty help? Because it looks like he hasn't even gotten over to the cooking thing that I asked him to do yet. And Neville is really, really sad. Can we... Um, let's babble to Lord Voldemort. Because that's what he wants to do. He also wants to ask Lord Voldemort for a drink. We don't need to do that. We don't drown our feelings in milk. Okay? That's not how we do. Ask to be read a book. Alright. We can ask him to read a book. Please, um... Can we... Do we have to help... No. Friendly flashcards. We haven't even done the flashcards very much. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, book help. Alright, Harry, what do you want to do, sweetie? You gotta go pee? Go reuse this one. Uh, Luna, are you still potty help from Severus? I know you're scared of him, but... Oh my goodness, what is this? Boogie Downer from Dancing to Music. If the dancing doesn't start, uh, doesn't soon cease, the tears might soon release. That's kind of adorable. Alright, so Hermione. Hermione wants to come over here. Let's play with the blocks. We'll go ahead and stack them. And Luna is still not getting the attention she needs. Alright. Potty help from Severus. Come on, Severus. I know you're trying to be cooking, but please help this little girl go pee. Don't you dare go ahead and potty train Luna because apparently Severus is too busy to help us out. Alright, Neville really needs attention, but I'm just going to have him go to sleep first. <laughs> Toddler lesson. Alright, I know he needs to be taken care of. His attention is so low, but honestly, he needs sleep too, so he can try to sleep for a little bit. Guys, Harry is using the potty all on his own. He's so good at it. <laughs> he just farted. Nasty. Alright, um, Hermione, how are you doing? Oh, she's so tired. Stop playing with blocks. You need to come over here and go to sleep. Oh, she's too scared to sleep right now? Is that from her nightmare? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, when you're done, please come over here and, uh, can we do something? Let's, oh, I don't want to yell at her. Let's, let's give her some comfort. And then, you know what? Just to, just give her a hug lovingly, just to let know, we know, she knows that we don't completely hate her. It's not her fault that she's good and we're evil and she's smart and we're silly and trying to take over the world. It's, it's not her fault. We just have clashing personalities. Alright, Luna is doing really good. She's getting her uh, her potty training up a little bit. Harry, Harry Posser, what are we doing with you? Um, you know, you might as well come over here and go to sleep too. I'm just worried about Hermione. She really needs attention and she needs to pee. Go potty while you wait because they are taking forever. She just needs to pee. Oh, she's she doesn't need to be comforted anymore, actually. She's good. She can go to the, she can go to bed on her own. Go to sleep when you're done peeing. Alright, how is this going? Are we getting anywhere closer to this potty train? Oh, she's almost done. And she's almost a level two. And then she can go potty all on her own. That'll be so nice. Alright, what are we even at for these kiddos? They age up in four more days. Oh my gosh, why is where are these all in the negative? Responsibility, emotional control, empathy. Oh my goodness, this is harder than I thought it would be. I hope we, hopefully we can raise these kids to be closer to what their uh, actual characters are, but um, figures Draco is dreaming about unicorns. The inside of his wand is a unicorn here, so that makes sense. All right, now we're sad because we had a potty accident. Why don't we babble to Lord, uh, or hug lovingly. 
You can't say no to Luna. And then comfort. I don't know if that'll help her or help him because... What? Oh, gosh. Glitch. Loving hug from across the room. Oh, my gosh. Alright, she needs to also ask for a drink. She doesn't need to do that, but... She wants to babble and watch Lord Voldemort. So maybe we can babble to him just real quick. She wants to comfort him. Oh my goodness. Look at that. If anyone was to turn Lord Voldemort's evil, cold, loveless heart warm again, it would be uh, it would be Luna. She breaks my heart. Alright. So we can we babble? Just get a want up. Okay, perfect. Not that we can really get anything for these rewards right now. Uh, maybe in the next part we'll have her ask him to show her flashcards. But for now, little girl, just go on to sleep. You might as well. So who all is going to need a bath soon? Ooh. Ooh, these little ones need attention. Oh, and Hermione's sleep is a lot. Okay, so everyone is still doing pretty okay with the bath situation. Uh, I am going to have Lord Voldemort go over here and attempt to take care of himself a little bit. Uh, we'll just do a regular shower and then have him go to sleep because he really just, he needs, he needs sleep. I'm surprised that uh, I never see Severus eating or sleeping. Did something happen? Is there like a glitch or something where the butlers, oh no, he's getting tired. Where they just keep going on and on and on without needing any kind of break? I'd be impressed. And now he's going to plop. Okay. So you guys, this is what happens when you try to take care of seven toddlers and you're basically a single dad and you don't know what you're doing. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Thank you so much for watching and uh, sticking through this challenge so far. I'm having so much fun and I hope you are too. And now Neville's awake and he needs attention. But anyways, uh, my name is Terranova and I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. Bye guys. Ooh.